Oh my gosh, he popped up right here, bro. Oh, he's in. There's, there's no point. There's no point. Hi. Why is it so quiet? <gasps> hey, what's up, YouTube? Fleek here. And welcome back to some more Residence Master. Now, in the last video for this game, we could just not beat this game. We ended up getting killed multiple times. I tried cameras out and all that. The cameras suck. Like, don't, they don't even show you where bro is. But today, we're gonna give it a shot. We're gonna do our best to beat it. Hey, without further ado, I hope you guys do enjoy and let go. So I got a little strategy going on here, guys. I got an idea. Also, we got the Halloween update right here. You can see the pumpkin. You actually can see how beautiful the fall foliage is in this Roblox game. All right, we're gonna go in here. Oh, and these pumpkins, you actually can smash them. And it'll give you things, but you can also get unlucky and it'll take damage. If you take damage from three pumpkins, you die. And you have to restart all over again. So grab our flashlight here. All right, so our little strategy today, guys, is I'm going to put one barricade on each of these windows. And hopefully that gives me enough time to get to the windows before he gets through. Like, look how nice this is, bro. Look at the sun. Look at the fall vibes outside, yo. All right, the upstairs is all barricaded as you can see and now we can go barricade downstairs. We went ahead Oh, I go check the generator one more and we good. All right, we're ready for this anomaly, bro So the plan is we're gonna scout downstairs now if we hear glass break We have to sprint up here as fast as we can and flash the light on him if he gets through before we get there We're dead. It's 12 a.m. Okay Downstairs. Oh, we forgot the extra batteries. Usually spawns batteries around the map. Keep that open. Where are you at? Dude, this is so creepy. How do they make Roblox this creepy, bro? Like, dang. Oh, you hear that settling in? Like, that's not normal. Woo! Okay, he's upstairs. He's upstairs. Oh, he's in there! Flip your light! Oh, he's in, he's in, he's in. There's, there's no point. There's no point. Hide. Hide. Yo, he's coming! Bro, if he gets in here, I'm gonna... Yo, how did he not see us? We literally saw him. Oh! Where? I can't see anything. Sounds like he just opened the door. Dude, did he leave? Oh, how did he not see me? The oxygen already? You know what? Drink up. Drink up the energy. What is up with our head? <laughs> we're gonna put three in. Dude, please don't be out here. Oh, we're in. Why is it so quiet? Oh! <gasps> No, no, stop! Eat that door! Oh, the door didn't shut! Oh, he's in there! No, the door shut! Ah! The freak is that? <laughs> he's some random ghost. Alright, that was attempt one. Crazy, bro. Like, we literally got up there in time. We saw, bro, right there. And we just could not get to it in time. We're back in once again. We're gonna try this little strategy again, and if it doesn't work, got a little strat in mind, all right? All right, we looking good, guys. We are all set up down here and upstairs. We gotta go check that freaking oxygen, though. All right, we're just gonna skip daytime, all right? We're gonna stay upstairs. He seems to hit upstairs so much for some reason, so... I guess it's just his favorite place to go. Oh, he's gotta slide back here in this freaking bathroom, too. He could just be there. So far, nothing. <gasps> oh my gosh, he popped up right here, bro. Look how crazy that is. Hold up, flicker him. Yeah, you get out of here. Shoot, the next time he jump scares us, we're gonna have to go out there and fix up the generators. I can just feel it. Oh, what'd I say? Oh, no, we have to quickly go. Two... Okay, two. Ah, no, no, stop. Oh, we're just so. I don't know if running does anything. Though. Yo, chill. Use house lights to scare it from the windows. How am I supposed to do that when I'm outside? So the second time, the generator. We gotta be more cautious of that generator. So my idea here, we already did our first option. You already know. Once he gets downstairs, he's just gonna break through that one little board, and then it's over. Like we're not gonna be able to get there in time, especially if it's a freaking window all the way downstairs near the door. So my idea is upstairs. Put everything we can on the upstairs window. 
Now think about this. He's gonna have more barricades at the breakthrough. Maybe we'll be able to do it. The downstairs, we don't leave anything on there. We just, we're gonna patrol downstairs all by ourselves, sprinting in circles. And once we see him, we just flicker the light. I mean, if we get there in time, he ain't gonna get through. Let's go ahead and give this a try. So now we got all the upstairs with one board and we're gonna go on to the next board here. So we're gonna see if we can start putting two boards on each. All right, look, so we got the bathroom maxed out. We got two on each window upstairs. Now this should, in theory, give us a better chance of survival, am I right? So we're gonna patrol down here. As you can see, there is nothing in these windows. If bro just breaks that glass and jumps through, it's over. But we're gonna be sprinting in circles like a madman <laughs> watching for this dude. 12 a.m. All right, so we go downstairs like we said. If he, show, if he shows up upstairs, we're gonna hear glass break, and all we gotta do is just go flicker a light on him if we get there in time. It just starts settling in with that noise right there. You hear that? Oh, he's right here! Ooh, hold up, hold up, buddy, hold up! Yeah, you get the freak out of here. Look at him running! So he runs all the way back in the woods? Yeah, that's right, buddy, you go back in that woods. Dude, he looks so creepy, too, with just the way he's built my thoughts exactly are he's probably gonna attack upstairs next but i want to stay down here because there's nothing protecting us down here dang it's taking him a minute i'm not gonna lie it's been quite a minute since he's done anything so once you scare him off you do have a good oh he broke it already bro tour through that oh it's the bathroom mate. oh he's right here get it get it Yo! we were right there all I had to do was flicker the light on. We literally identified where he was. See, it's just too hard, bro. It's it's insane. Bro breaks through instantly, and it's over. Like, you heard how fast he took that glass down, and then the barricade? All right, so we're gonna have to call up for some backup, all right? Because we just, we can't do it. It's almost impossible. I'm gonna take a little break, and I'll see you guys in, in a bit. You got upstairs, and I got downstairs. Over here. Ha! Gotcha, buddy. And then the next time he jumps and we have to flicker him, I'm going to go out and do the gasoline. Over here. Ha. Got him. I'm going to go out and do the uh, gasoline. <laughs> 2 a.m., baby. After his next jump scare, I'm going to have to go out there again. Why is it so quiet? What the heck? Over here. Get out of here, buddy. Yeah, look at that. It's literally about to be out. All right, two. Sprint, sprint, sprint. It's 4 a.m. Right here. Woo! Get out of here. I'm pretty sure he's going to be upstairs now. There you go. Good stuff. 5 a.m. Okay, I'm, I'm heading out. I have to get the oxygen. The moon is yellow. What the heck? Okay, I got you. Dude, my stamina. Where? Survive night one. We were almost about to die there too, bro. I saw the freaking screen. It was making the noise. Thank you, Black Ozu. <sighs> Appreciate it. All right, guys. There you guys have it. We have finally beat the first night of Residents Massacre. Now, there might be more nights, I'm assuming, since it said the first night has been beaten. And we're definitely gonna hit that up in the future, so don't worry. But hey, for now, we leave it off here. I wanna thank you all so much for watching. Please do leave a like on this video and subscribe to become part of Uchiha. Besides that, I hope you did enjoy, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace! Peace.